of destruction. But Nippler simply couldn't sustain it. Carbide were they waiting their moment? That's where the blue bot boy says he loves the release of seeing things destroyed. Always the quiet ones, isn't it? From Reading, Aftershock, Spinner. You're a teacher. Yeah. You kind of expect them to be upholding, you know, citizens. And in then... the classroom, yeah. Okay. In the arena, it's sort of go, go for it. I'm a complete monster in there. The school days are very regimented. You get in at eight o'clock. You teach your classes. You go home. When we're doing Robot Wars, it's it's chaos. Oh dear! Stop! Got order in one half, and then complete and utter unparalleled chaos in the other. Dreams shattered. Machine in shards. They're dead. Well, they're dead. <laughs> I need to get in that arena, and I need to rip stuff apart, and I. You know, I can't really explain why. He keeps saying I've done a little bit too much. He's got a kill switch now. So if I'm going too destructive, he can just turn me off and I, I just can't do anything. Like when the eyes light up and they're red, yeah. then you know that's when you switch them off. That's what it's all about. OK, I mean, that's a little bit terrifying. The final team in this group. Come on, let's have this battle. Roboteers, stand by. OK, hey, who's your money on? Corruption. Is this? I'm going to Aftershock. Two. One. Activate. Aftershock grand finalist twice. Eruption runners up last time around. The cluster for the crackers and smash. And Aftershock immediately after the green crackers machine. Pushing it into a CPZ, but the house robots aren't there. That's OK. Aftershock now pressing in on the smash. Oh! And look at that! Part of the floor flipper has been ripped out. Come on, guys, you're in the flip for sluggers. Stop, stop, down, stop. Will, down, down. Cease has not been called. They must go off. Are they going to stop that? I don't know, actually. Bit of consternation up in the control booth. Down, 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 down Will. Stop, 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 stop. stop, stop no, no, stop. no, don't stop crackers and smash. The cease hasn't been called. You've got to go on. Aftershock have realised that eruption didn't stop at all. This could open up for eruption now. Because of that confusion, I'll tell you what, there'll be tears after this. Fire down, Will. They cease. No cease. Go on. Fine, then. Keep fighting. Look at the focus on the face of Michael Oates. And look at the power of eruption. Oh, oh. oh my God. Michael kept his call, kept his focus. He saw the perfect opportunity and he took it. That'll cause an upset, I'm sure. Out goes Aftershock, that's a massive surprise this early. Now he's after the little cluster bots. He's after, in particular, Crackers. Smashed against Serena Wall while Smash does absolutely nothing. This is a hugely powerful eruption machine. Michael flipped four of five opponents out of the arena in the last series. And he started where he left off. You don't want to be there. You really don't want to be there. Yeah, you know where now. He's going for the third. Then there was just the one. And he's after that one now. And he's got as well. Patrick. Oh, that was a good one. And we're in the trench. Well done. Complete whitewash. Brilliant eruption. Yeah, I, I stand over my prediction. It. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What a battle that was. That was stunning. That was stunning. <laughs> Absolutely stunning, yeah. Wow. What's that? What's, what's... Yeah. Well, no, we, we were told to stop, so we stopped. So... Who, who yelled stop? Someone was shouting. Oh, you, you, sh you were shouting oh, stop, so I stopped. Yeah, I, shouted, stop. I shouted it because I thought nobody you noticed you that the, the yeah, pit no. was up. Well, no, I stopped because you shouted stop, well, so that's why I stopped. Well, they were saying cease, cease, and I said stop to the pit. Yeah, yeah, yada, yada, yada. Up it comes. You can see part of the floor flipper being ripped away by that powerful Aftershock 2400 RPM vertical flywheel. But this is the moment Aftershock came to the end of this bout. Eruption, the mighty, mighty fling from that full pressure pneumatic flipper. And the rest knew then they were in peril. And Eruption simply wanted them all gone. Mighty style. This is a hugely impressive first battle. This was the moment that changed the fight for me. Aftershock damaging the flipper before being thrown into the air by Eruption as it bounced out of that arena.
right, I'm, I'm taking you for a walk through this, right? Look at that thing. See yeah. that? See that bendy bit there? Right, next bit, next bit, right? See this I'm holding here? Put yeah. it, it's still warm. Put it in your hand, oh. right? Yeah, it's still warm, right? That's from there. That lives wow. there, right? It's not there anymore. Right, this bit, right? See this? Oh that was God. a working flipper, right? I am sending you an invoice because you are ruining my house. We've got to rebuild that again, right? Yeah. The only thing, back over here, the only thing that's keeping me happy about this is that you ended up out there. Safest place for it, I think. Probably was, actually, yeah. Flipped by you. Yeah. Enjoy, enjoy that? Did you enjoy that? Did you enjoy the sensation? I, yeah, I mean, there was a bit of confusion with the arena flipper being destroyed. Some people thought the fight was over. Play to the whistle, you know. lads. If a big, if a big yeah. siren goes off, we stop. Otherwise, you keep fighting because... Yeah. Did we not enjoy the bit where he hiked him out? But that is literally the point of this yeah. entire yeah. exercise, oh, is. is for one of you to take the other one and oi, out. Yeah. yeah, I suppose, yeah. So, I mean, from our, yeah, I mean, we've not got any damage as such. We've got a little bit. <laughs> no, oh, no, no. Some of your stickers have That, that comes wrote. later, the damage. We'll get you later. <laughs> OK, there may be yet be a rematch, because you, you go yeah, channeling yeah, yeah, back yeah, in against so. this one. You go into the redemption bout, yep. you go into the quarterfinals that we do it, uh, and you go straight through to the semi-final. Yeah. Give it up for eruption, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> After the post-mortem continues. It was my fault. I wouldn't worry. Right, we'll we'll stop. Stop. Hey, no, don't worry. We we'll beat him up later. <laughs> Touch of confusion. We saw the flipper get damaged. I think we did the damage to the flipper, didn't yeah. we? Yeah. And then um, this gentleman over here, yeah, yeah. he shouts, stop. I so I, and I've got, I panicked and said, Will, cease, cease, cease. Stop, 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 stop. Fire down, Will. Not ceasing, it was. He was powering down, uh, and then a certain young man called Michael um, <laughs> rear ended us. <laughs> My son did the right thing. He waited for the official cease. He, he, he just did. carried on. Yeah, so, he, um, fair play. He, yeah, he, he, yes. I mean, best mates. They have apparently a little pact where they get rid of the opponents before each other and it looked like he picked off Aftershock before Crackers and Smash, so maybe the pact, you know. There's bruised hearts as well as bruised robots. I take this incredibly seriously. And anyone who knows me will tell you I am super competitive. Make no mistake, this is a really serious competition and everyone's here to win. This is our last chance of redemption in the competition, so we've got to go in and just annihilate them, really. Yeah. It's all out. We've um, yeah, got to make the most of this second chance. We didn't have enough red mist in the last one. We've got to come in, yeah. just go for it, like I used to. This time, no holding back, and just, yeah, yeah we've got to smash yeah. it. In the arena for this battle, the ever so pushy Shunt and the equally persuasive Sir Kinnerot. Three, two, one, activate. This, to stay in this heat of Robot Wars, the winner goes through to the semi-final. Aftershock, splendidly tossed out of the arena in that early battle. Now fighting with Gabriel 2 to survive. You can see the mace of Gabriel 2, you can see the concentration on the face of Will Thomas. Is he evil? Go in and kill him. That was his verdict early on. It was a good attack there, wasn't it? Gabriel 2 flew through the air. But it can take that. Yeah, it can. It, it, it bounces back well. Certainly does. That high-density polyethylene plastic is designed to take on those purple spinners. It's working. The tyres took the punishment as it bounced down, took the shock of the landing, and they're up and over the big vertical flywheel of Arthur's shot. Now, that could be crucial. Gabriel 2's ground clearance seems to take it up and over the flywheel so very easily. And it does have that entanglement chain out there, which seems to have been eaten away. Oh, well, oh, there's the entanglement stuff. Oh, good. Just that works, kind Simple nylon rope attached to Gabriel 2. If it gets caught inside that spinning disc, it could disable that aftershock weapon. And with it, Will strings. Will, there's plenty of entanglement around. A little bit of instruction there from Ian who used to work on fighter jets. Leave him be, just wander around. Son will at the controls. And in underneath, Gabriel 2. This is a tense one. Now, is Gabriel OK? Oh, such a shame, he actually got them. 
Gabriel Chu is not moving. It's not moving. It's not moving. No, not moving. Yeah. Gabriel Chu is in the claws of Sir Killalot. Oh, Killalot! No, not the mace. Oh, no, not the mace. Oh, dear, oh, dear. How cruel is that? Well done, Killalot. We love it. We love it. Chopped his head off. <laughs> Gabriel Chu. Great battle. Great bravery. Bye bye. Oh, well done. Oh, well done, kids. Sorry. Oh, no, you did so well against Carvide. OK, well, well done. done. Well done. I like it, Sobes. It's OK. Come on, mate. You're right. Yeah, yeah, I'll be fine. Oh, yeah, it's all right to see you all right now. Will is evil. Though the first time the entanglement looked like it might yeah, actually be good for something. Did the entanglement work? Did it really? The flails there trying to stop the flywheel. Not too sure it really worked. Gabriel Chu up on one wheel. That's better use of the entanglement. Look at that there. That's what it's there for. But look at the flywheel just chomping it up, spitting it out. Came in again on Gabriel Chu. Up on its side. Gabriel Chu landing there with 110 kilos of weight. I think something got shook up inside. And it was a heavyweight KO blow from Aftershock. Oh, well, the mace is broke. There's also hearts breaking all around the arena <laughs> to see Gabriel go home. I know, it's a bit of a sad thing, really. We just needed one less hit, yeah. and uh, I think we should have been OK, but um, uh, Aftershock is a fantastic robot, and the, uh, the team are just great. And uh, hats off to them, yeah. like that. <laughs> that one, like that. that. Please make some noise for Gabriel. After a fantastic start against Champions Carbide, Gabriel too are now out of the car. After Shocker there, they've put on their Carbide blade. This is a weapon that they've designed specifically to deal with Carbide because they were beaten by them in the grand final. So this is payback time. Will and Ian are looking a bit more worried than they, I think, would like, but they've got more speed. They've got more power, and they're going to try and take down the champions. It's almost time for you to get in. This looks like quite complex work to be doing at the last minute. Yeah, I mean, we swapped our disc out for a new bar, and while doing that, we found our weapon motor was uh, seized. Oh. So we're swapping over to a brand new one. Yeah, OK. Can you do it? Oh, yeah, we can. Let's have a look at Aftershock. Will and Ian Thomas have been fighting robots for 10 years. They've made the grand final twice. 24 kilo spinner has a tip speed of around 140 miles an hour. Although spinning slower than some other spinners, it carries more weight at the edge, which means it delivers more kilojoules of energy into its opponents. Team captain Will is a mild mannered design and technology teacher by day. This Jekyll and Hyde of robot ball says he loves the release of seeing things destroyed. Always the quiet ones, isn't it? The robot to beat again this year, Carby, with a brutal 25 kilo bar spinning at 240 miles an hour. The team, Sam Smith and Dave Moulds, upgraded the already incredibly powerful robot by a further 20%. I think Sam and Dave will have to work harder this year, we know that, to keep ahead of the pack. Can they handle the pressure? In the arena, the single scoop of pain with Shunt and the waffle cone of destruction with Sir Killalot. Will we have a repeat of the last series final or will Aftershock face off against Best Friend Eruption? I think if anyone can dethrone the champion at this early stage, it could be Aftershock. I think we should hide from the metal bar bit. Three, two, one. Activate. Aftershock with the one-tooth solution, the new blade, especially for Carbide. Carbide with the new batteries for a battle like this. Oh! Well, they're untroubled so far, Carbide. They came together there. Will Thomas trying to get that one-tooth solution working on Carbide, and it, it looks to be causing damage. Uh, the champions here are up against it. Huge impact between both machines. Tom's gone, Will. Uh, this gone. It's gone. The one-two solution. I think it's gone. I don't think it's working. And Carbide now senses they've got a chance to come in. Aftershock planned that weapon so that they wouldn't take so many damaging hits from Carbide. 
Are they dead? We we done or what? I think we're done, yeah. Yeah, we're still. Will Thomas is down, Jules! Oh, Aftershock is totally dead, yeah. so they're just being kind. Well, they were causing so much trouble for the champions, but the champions' reign continues thus far. Oh, dear, poor old Will Thomas. Yeah, I, I, think, I, think, I, I think we lost the drive mode early on. No, no, it's still... I think you've jammed it with the wheel. Will is going to be very disappointed with that. That was their carbide-proof weapon. Good slam, weapon to weapon. Still working after shot there. And I think they have the potency really to cause damage. But once that one tooth blade stopped whirring, Carbide sends victory. And that was a big slam on the, look at the slam on the side of Carbide and the damage caused there. But they simply couldn't sustain it. Carbide, were they waiting their moment? That's where it went. That's the end of the blade. And that, of course, was the start of the moment when Carbide were on top. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. It's OK. Feeling? It'll be all right, well yeah. Done, Sam. High Thanks. five. Team captain, that's working out all right for you. Yeah, we yeah. were we were definitely worried about that one. I mean, yeah. um, Aftershock is, a, is an amazing machine, and um, we reckon it really was 50-50 going into that. Mm. So. Do you want to see the fatal blow? Oh, yeah. Let's have a look. Oh, wow. It's, it's a great hit, but it looks like it just took... Oh, big nick out the yeah, bar at the top. Yeah, big nick. Good off the cut there. It's, yeah. It feel different good. watching it back than when you're in the middle of it. Yeah, it's, it, um, it was so quick. It's like, it feels like 10 seconds in there. Well, you need to go and get ready. You still have a good bit of work to do. Oh, yeah. Right, off you go. Good luck. Oh, well done. Well cheers. done, lads. Thanks. Well done. Three, two, one. Activate. Two worthy machines in this very, very good heat. Aftershock. Top of your picture, Big Nipper. Oh, hello. Skipping around a bit there. Big Nipper is the quicker of the two machines. Aftershock has the bigger of the vertical. Oh, brilliant. You're upside down, you're right, done. Oh, I live for moments like that, you know. Well, that'll keep me in memories for many a month. Strange life I lead. Well, that's something. They're still going. How are they both still working? Anyway, it's Arthur Shock and Big Nipper out there who will live to fight another day. They're like right in each other. Arthur Shock, tossed and turned. No, I'm coming out of it, I can't see. Wait for it to spin up. And comes in again. But this is a good control Big Nipper. We're seeing out here, and we're seeing a beaten Aftershock, I think. Aftershock is gone. Well, that's going to make it easier. It. Yeah. Yeah, right. we're out, we're out. The control of Big Nipper was decisive. Well, well, well. They've been immobilised. Very, very controlled Big Nipper team. Well done, guys. Well done, guys. Well done. Good fight. Well, it was the tuck early on. Power Blade against Power Blade, the big vertical wheels of destruction. But Nipper, for me, was the more poised machine. Big, big slam there, wasn't it? Big Nipper again, aggressive, forcing the issue. Up goes after shot. Pirouetting. The Big Nipper knew, I think, they had the fight, and which meant that Graham Dawson could come in time and time again, and that was the decisive moment. Good win, Big Nipper.